Hey guys, this is Anna and I have another quick tip for Silhouette Studio for you. Um, this tip is about working with fonts within your Silhouette Studio files that you're creating yourself. So here I've got a file I've created. I've actually used three different fonts here and my tip is that I always like to make a note um, in this file what fonts I have used. Um, so I'm going to look here and see if I double click the text to edit it, click on the top line, it's a font called Blackjack. The second line is Impact and the final font is called Sacramento. So what I would do is just make a new text area here, a new text box by using the text tool on the left and type in what fonts I used just as a note to myself, not anything I'm going to cut. Um, so the fonts used were Blackjack, Impact, and Sacramento. And then, you know, I'm going to size them down a little bit. I'm going to fill them in with black so they're easier to read. Um, and just drag it off the mat. Um, and now let me tell you why I do this. Because um, it may be less obvious that you would need this to people who are not using Silhouette Studio the same way I am. Um, I have a Silhouette machine, Silhouette Cameo at work, and one at home. Um, and so I actually use Silhouette Studio on several different computers. Um, and not all of those computers have the same fonts. That's what made me start making these font notes. Um, because I, if you open this same file on a computer that does not have the Sacramento font installed, this is just going to look like some default font, like a Times New Roman or Arial or something like that. And it doesn't give you any hint about what font it is that you're missing. There's no way to find it out. Now you may be saying to yourself, I only use Silhouette Studio on one computer. Why would I need this tip? Well, if you ever, um, God forbid, lose that computer or your fonts get deleted, or maybe you need to, uh, you get a new computer and you're going to start using Silhouette on a new computer, it may be that you start to open your files and you cannot recall what same fonts you had installed. And so this is just a note to yourself so that if you ever have to open it on a different computer or without your same fonts installed, you'll be able to see what fonts you needed. Um, this is also helpful if you're sharing the file with others. So just a quick tip about managing fonts in your Silhouette Studio files that you create.